Hi, it's Zoon. I'm going to be showing you how to make these cute little pants that are available in 8 sizes from 6 months to 5 years. This pattern is totally free and you can get it at ZoonSewingTherapy.com. Please like and subscribe to my blog and channel so I can keep bringing to you more free patterns and tutorials. If there are any patterns and tutorials you'd like to see, please leave a comment below. You can also follow me on social media and keep up to date on all the free patterns for kids, adults and much more. Alright, so let's start with a list of things we will need. I've included a link to the pants pattern below. The first page of the pattern has the 1 inch test square, so I always recommend printing out the first page and checking the test square before printing out all the other pages. Make sure to check off do not scale or actual size on your printer. Also, be sure to check the proportions between the finished garment measurements and the child's measurements before cutting out the fabric. Put the pattern together by matching the gray rectangles and either tape or glue the papers. After checking the measurements, cut out the size that you want. The inseam and outseam have a 3 8 inch seam allowance included. I just added another a quarter inch seam allowance because I'm using my serger. So feel free to add or detract from the seam allowance. Press fabric so there are no wrinkles and then fold it. Place the pattern on top and cut out the fabric. Fold each piece and sew the inseams with a 3 8 inch seam allowance. Serge or zigzag the raw edges to keep them from fraying. Turn one right side out and insert it into the other piece. Match the crotch seams first and then pin all around.
sew with a 3 8 inch seam allowance and then finish the edges with a zigzag stitch or a serger. Cut a piece of ribbon that's about 2.5 inches long. This will be the tag that goes on the inner back side of the pants. Also cut out the waistband. The width is 2 and 3 quarters of an inch and the length of the waistband should be the same as the waist measurement of the pants. My waistband ended up being 23 inches instead of 22 inches because I skipped pressing the fabric before I started cutting. Place the ribbon tag on the inside of the pants and tack it down about an eighth of an inch from the raw edge but within the quarter inch seam allowance. Fold the waistband in half and make a ring by sewing it closed with a quarter inch seam. Pin the waistband to the pants right sides together and sew with a quarter inch seam. Press the waistband up. Fold and press the raw edge of the waistband a quarter of an inch. Bring the fold down so that it's touching the first seam line. Sew close to the edge. Leave about a 2 inch opening for the elastic to be inserted. For the elastic, I usually cut it 2 inches shorter than the waist measurement plus half an inch if I'm overlapping. So my elastic was 17 and a half inches long. Mark the measurement on the elastic and pin a safety needle through one end. Insert the elastic through the opening of the waistband and pull on the safety pin until it comes out on the other side of the opening. Overlap the elastic edges and zigzag stitch over it several times and then shut the opening by sewing close to the folded edge. The hem is the last thing that needs to be done. Fold up 3 quarters of an inch. Either press or use pins to hold the fold up. Fold under again a quarter of an inch so that the fold that's facing you is only half an inch big. Then sew close to the folded edge. And that's it. Please like, share, and subscribe to my channel and my blog so that I can continue to bring to you more free sewing patterns and tutorials. Thank you for watching. Bye!